Hi, this is Nick and I'm with Atlantic Laser Scanning. We get a lot of people new to scanning that contact us. They want to use their Ferro scanners to scan the interior and exteriors of a building, but they want it to be part of one project. In other words, they want the registration to tie the exterior and the interior of the building together. It's not a hard thing to do, but it relies on one critical scan called a threshold scan we're going to cover today. This is going to remain true whether you're reconnecting the exterior and interior of a building or if you're just going through a building and scanning the interior of, say, an office building. You want to include hallways, office spaces, you know, open spaces. All these things rely on what's called a threshold scan. You need to be able to connect the exterior and interior or a hallway in a room. So we can see in this quick video, we've got a scan position on the outside of this building that's scanning from the parking lot in the front. We've moved all the way around to this position. We're going to be going in through door number five. Now, this scan position is finished. We're going to be moving the scanner and we can't just move it to the center of the room inside. We're going to have to get, put the scanner into the threshold of the doorway. Why is this done? We need to be able to see what we've scanned previously outside, as well as what we're going to be scanning on the inside. Now, a lot of you are going to say, well, the scanner can't pick up the walls and everything from the exterior scan. How is it therefore going to be able to tie it all together? We'll roll in a little bit and we'll see. It's a good question. Sometimes if you're using targets on the exterior of the building, you'll be able to see targets from this position, but we don't need to in this case. First of all, we see the next scan in the threshold is going to capture the inside of the room and the exterior. The inside of the room is critical because the next scan following this is going to be the center of this room. Obviously, the scanner is going to pick up most of the room from this position, but the critical part as we roll forward is it's picking up geometry from the previous scan location on the outside. As you can see, we had a building that was present as we were scanning the side of the brick building here. We were also capturing this building here. So from the position of the threshold scan, we're able to see the interior of this room as well as what we saw previously in the other scans, which is the geometry of this building next door. That's why this is going to work. Again, this is something that's going to be critical for scanning the interior of an office building or a hotel or a ship. Anytime that you're connecting rooms to hallways or rooms to rooms or exteriors to interiors, the threshold scan is absolutely critical. It's not even a bad idea to scan the threshold and then maybe take a step in or the just outside of the threshold and then a threshold scan and then take a step in and do another. Believe me, it's much easier to take four or five minutes to pop an extra scan in the field than to try to put it together when it doesn't automatically register in your recap or your scene. Hope this helps you guys. Good luck on your next project.